This is the Superstition Mountain, right? Mountain Mystery 3-Gun, one of the longest running 3-Gun events in the country, period. Yes. Probably Are you ready? Stand by. I like having stages where, okay, this is area A, yes. this is area B, figure it out. The train over here on stage 10, or stage 11. Um, Greg Harrington and his wife Denise and a, some friends of theirs built that at home. We got it out here, we set it out here three days before the match in our prep stage. Hey Dave, good to see you, bud. Hey Patrick, what do you think of the what do you think of the stage? Uh, it went really good. I had one little bump on the shotgun, but overall I yeah, felt it was good. There's another three gun stage. All three guns. Correct. Yep. Yeah. Start out. There's a lot going on with that rifle. I mean, you stood, it's watching it from my side, from the camera side, spending a lot of time there. Dave, and it has to feel that yeah. way to you. It's like, come on, swinger, come into view, because you got to wait for the up. target to appear to hit it. Correct. Yep. Yes. Yep. Um, how many years you've been at this match? Hey. Do you remember offhand? Uh, probably. That's one of the best times I've seen, and you got to clean. Best time? No, it's not the best time, but one of the best. Clean. And it clean. Woohoo! We like that. Good yeah. shooting. Appreciate it. Thank right you. Right on. Probably seven years. Seven years. Seven, eight years. Right on. I yeah. dig it. And you brought your wife this year. I did. Ain't yeah. that cool? Oh, it's awesome, man. Maybe that's why you're shooting so well. I, I know she's going to I, I hope so. Hey, man, you're more than welcome to take a minute. Who do you got for sponsors this year? Buddy, uh, you know, I'd love to thank Miltac. Um, they build awesome rifles, Locally co local company in Idaho. Really? Love them. Oh, cool. And obviously Hornady and Leupold. I mean, uh, without them, it's hard to hard to play this game. So. Hard to play the game at this level without some kind of level support. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and all three companies are awesome to work with, and they have awesome products. Love it, dude. Thanks, man. Buddy, Appreciate thank you. Buddy. Thanks, See you. Sixteen. I've been training since he was ten.
Richard Bella comes up with stages. I swear he stays up late nights and drinks heavily to come up yes. with some of the stuff he does. Yes. But he does some wonderful stages he comes up with. And other people come up with great stages too. So sometimes we'll say, Richard, okay, this one's good, but this one's better. And this one's submitted by Fred over here. Right, right. So he gets in. We take a look at him. We, we try to make the best mix. I'm out here with Greg Williams, a buddy of mine I've known for several years. I noticed she was just a little this, and she makes him embarrassed. I noticed she was just only this high. Typical old guy. Anyways, this is your third year here. Mm -hmm. uh, you've been shot this match for the last three years. You started when you were 13 here, 13. and you're 16 now. Mm -hmm. A lot of sponsors should be in 16. How do you do that? You good dude? I guess. <laughs> what do you got for sponsors? Uh, tactical machining, black hole weaponry, uh, shooting innovations. Hodgson powder, CMC triggers. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I like it. You had some really good runs. Everyone's had their ups and downs. So you got to know that going in. I do want to go scope out the next stage. This last run, you actually beat me, which <laughs> shouldn't be beating the old man. Nicely done, dude. Great shooting with you. Thanks, man. Yeah, you gotta talk to me. Had a pretty good run, second day of Superstition Mystery Mountain here. Uh, Radical firearms rifle, collis optics, and CNC trigger. One for one on our long range steel at 310 yards. Zevtech Glock ran perfect through the array, about 28 rounds, mag change in there, so great stage. Excellent run, dude, thank you. Thank you. So, there, you really have a dedicated crew, man. We do. Year after year after year, I see the same people. Some new faces, yeah. and then the same hardcore, chiseled features, absolutely burnt from the sun, yeah. and they got a smile on their face all day. Oh, it's good to see you, man. Good to see you, Pat. Uh, year after year, I keep coming back to this match, and it's about the match. So well run, such a tight ship, and you guys are always fun and friendly. How do you do that after, what, 20 plus years? Yeah, we've been here 22 years doing this and having a ball. Um, you know, we love seeing the new shooters. We yep. love getting people involved in our sport. And if I can be a part of that, I'm happy to do so. So it's a pleasure for me to be on the stage. How long have you been doing this match? This particular match, uh, I think from the fifth year was when I first started it. Why? Well, for a number of years, I was on the design committee to oh, design okay. these stages and put on the matches. Right? And I decided, you know what? I have so much fun. 
interacting with the competitors, seeing them year after year after right. year, and what they bring and the kind of new equipment, it's, it's just a camaraderie yeah, there is. Of, of being a shooter myself and being amongst all the rest of the shooters that make it worth the while. Palmer, dude, friends. thank you so much, buddy. Thank you, it's been really my pleasure. pleasure. We had a great time. Take care, Pat. All right, buddy, talk to you, you later. a good one. Thanks, man. Bye-bye. I take a lot of counsel from a lot of people, and uh, the counsel is invaluable. It Absolutely. Is just, it's one of those things where people come up, because how many times have you ever had somebody look at you and you, sit, you think to yourself, the hell was I thinking? Exactly. What? Are you? Yep. That's a brilliant idea. Yeah. How come I didn't think of it? Exactly. Yeah. Hey guys, here with Bruce Pyatt. Just, just ran the stage in heavy, heavy metal, higher, heavy limited, heavy limited. So it's iron sight, 308, 20 rounds, yep. pump shotgun, 12 gauge only, and a 45 ACP pistol. Yep, 10, 10 rounds. 10 rounds. 10 rounds. Right. Uh, the run started off looking really good. The pump just didn't work quite right. It's like you got missed your load counter. Um, I had a couple of misses on the bird. Ah, oh, okay. I had a, a moving bird, and I just had a couple of misses. Right, right. And it's tough to run through a port, so you don't get that nice big swing, and you're still running a pump. Yep, yep. And I was just laid on the swingers. Yes. So by the time you get on it, they were just disappearing as I got to them. So. Aro still said it was a pretty good run, though. Yeah, it was the fastest uh, heavy limited. So. Well, there you go. Yeah. Even when you don't get your out at your best, it's a good run. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. people that work literally for six months making sure this match goes off. You take this task and your job is to do prize table contact sponsors. I don't have to micromanage anybody. Why not? Mick, my pleasure. Dude, how long have you been doing this? Let's see, I, this match I've been the prize coordinator for like three years. It's difficult to solicit prizes for matches. 
Walk me through the process and what it takes so, in your months or weeks leading up to a match. So I start this. This match is typically last, last week of March every year. Right. I start typically in late July or August and start sending out you know, the customary emails. A lot of the sponsors know us, they, they recognize us, sure. they remember us, and they've been longtime sponsors. Right. And the reputation of the match also helps. Truly. What got you three gun? What, what, why three gun? Because if pistol is fun, three gun is three times fun. It really, we say that, it's almost cliche, but it's absolutely no, true. No, it's, it, it's absolutely true. It's absolutely true. Next year is our 20th anniversary match. Oh, okay. Um, we're going to try and bring back some of the best of the best from 20 years. Brilliant idea. I talked to other match directors and say, you know, if Disneyland changed every time you went and you're going to bring your kids along, yeah. oh, all the rides are going to change. They change them every year? Why? Yeah. So it'd be nice to bring back the best of. Because yeah. everyone's like, oh, I get a chance to do that again. I love that stage. 